Hey, it's Kelly. Hey guys, if you are a new subscriber from my last video, the um, Ross review, thank you for subscribing so much. I hope you enjoy my content. I'm going to be trying to um, upload a lot more. So in today's video, it's going to be Prismacolor um, 21 piece art kit. So today I wanted to test this out. I got this for $9.99. So let's switch cameras so you can see more in depth what's inside this box. Okay guys, let's open this bad boy up. So like I said, Prismacolor art kit, um, you can see it has here. So let's open it. So it has a very protective foam, nice, doesn't get damaged. And from off the bat, it looks like I just have an array of like rainbow colors. They look like the normal Prisma colors that I have. And there it says Prisma, the color, and the color number, I believe. Non-photo blue. Okay. Looks like I have like pastels. Um, let me see. Okay. Oh, okay. So it says Prisma watercolor. So I didn't know Prisma had a watercolor range in the first place so that's pretty cool um prisma color watercolor rose and then here it says pink i guess it's describing them more i thought this one was pink but i guess not so this is prisma color watercolor ah sorry it's my dog See if she smiles. <laughs> she does this thing where she smiles. So I'm gonna try to continue. <laughs> okay. So this one looks like. Stop it. Look at she's smiling. Do you see it? <laughs> no. No. Get down. She wants to be all up here. No. Time to go outside. Let's go. So nosy. One moment, guys. Sorry. So, like I was saying, I thought this one was pink, but it's actually red. I've never tried their water range set. Like I said, I didn't even know they had these. I'm sorry if you hear screaming in the background. There's kids in my neighborhood playing. Oh, this is a Prismacolor red. Um, Crins in red. So this is going to be pretty cool to try out. Maybe I can, like, do something with the background with these so I can, like, involve everything. Okay. Cool little range so it looks like this one is colorless so this is a blender i am familiar with the um prisma color um products some um, not these ones <laughs> but this is the blender this helps blend colors between each other and then i have used their prisma color pencils before i do have like their own little set i like these this is the hb and then it comes with Prisma markers, black. Okay, so it looks like this is like a felt tip, chunkier one on this side. And then this side, if I can open it. Watch it doesn't open. <laughs> is a very skinny tip. See if you can see it. So that's pretty cool. It comes with both sides. And then I got another one. Oh, I got two. This is black as well. So I wonder why they said two. Same thing. Maybe. Ah. Oh, no, no, no. This is different. Okay. Cool. So it's not the exact same thing. This is more like a brush, brush marker. I like these kind of markers a lot better. Cool. And it's black as well. And then this side. Okay, this side's the same as the other one. So it looks like the exact same. Do you guys see a difference? I really don't. Okay, so it's okay. That's fine. And then it comes with a sharpener. Standard sharpener. And that's pretty cool because you can like sharpen and you don't need a... The only thing that's missing is a racer. That's it. But 
really not necessary. So let me actually sharpen the pencil so we can get started sketching. But what I'm first gonna do is swatch the these colors here and then fill how they are. Cause I know how like typical Prisma colors are. So I'm gonna see if I feel a difference. So this might be sped up. Okay guys, so that is the swatches of the colors. So these colors, the way they swatch is perfect. They are just like the regular Prisma colors and that's just from muscle memory. A positive note right there. Um, that's one thing I was worried about if they were gonna be the same quality because they're from Ross, I, I wasn't too sure. Um, at the end, I'm gonna add up each one of these and then tell you how much it would actually cost to buy these all separate and see if it's the same price more or less we'll find out so the next thing we're gonna try and i'm excited about this one because i haven't tried these before are these watercolor pencils let me swatch these let me put them in order these feel exactly the same as the regular ones so i'm wonder if these ones are able to do it let i'll test if a regular one could do the watercolor as well Okay, so I got a paintbrush. I got a little bit of water. And they say watercolor, so I've never used these kind. I've used watercolor pencils before, but never Prisma. So let me dip in just a little bit. And those are the watercolor sets. Okay, I have no issue with those ones. Um, they worked, they blended out perfectly. Um, I can't wait to use them. Let me, um, I wanna try just by like curiosity, I wanna know if these are able to do this. Cause if it is, then why buy this? But I doubt it. Let's see, I'm gonna turn the page and then we'll um, put a regular one, so. We'll do blue. So this is the um, the regular. Get my brush, wet it a little bit, and no. <laughs> okay, so definitely not. See, it's not even picking up at all. And then I'll show you the difference. I think that residue is from like the uh, the other ones. Let me get the other blue. I dip my brush in. This is the blue. See? Yeah. Definitely not the same color pencils. You can do the same thing as the regular ones. So at least my curiosity was proven. I'm gonna do a couple little, um, maybe some thumbprints, so like thumbnails, so I can see an idea of what I want to do. So I'm gonna ask you guys on Instagram, frog or parrot? So we'll see with this, which one I should do. So if you wanna follow me on Instagram so you're updated with like any kind of polls or questions, you'll know upcoming videos. Okay, so I asked you guys on Instagram, frog or parrot? And the winner was
this frog it was 56 to 44 so this frog um the whole process of doing this was great my final thoughts on this product is i think it's worth the buy for all the products you get you really can do so much with this the only one that really didn't work out for me was the watercolors the butt that is because of my paper if i use a different paper it'll work out no problem so that's the end of the video i hope you guys enjoy it don't forget before you leave to subscribe, like, and comment so that we can chat. Um, I would love to hear from you guys. And my last video, just to remind you guys, the giveaway. Don't forget to enter in it March 31st. So the announcement will be April 1st. Have a great day, guys. Bye.